Let's have a quick look at multiplying numbers using a TI-84. There are two ways I can do this. In this expression, 3 times 5, I see that we are using the traditional multiplication symbol that you are familiar with from elementary school. This is the same as the multiplication operator that you will see on your calculator. So we can simply enter 3 times 5. Note that your calculator represents the multiplication operation not with an X but with an asterisk. 3 times 5 and I hit enter and of course I get my resultant value of 15. A far more common way to multiply in an algebra course, however, is to simply write the two values that you are multiplying right next to each other with one of them in parentheses if necessary. This is called implied multiplication. There is no operator in between to show us what we're to do. We simply know that if they're written next to each other, they're multiplied. So your calculator will take implicit multiplication if you use parentheses to type in this value, your calculator will understand that that is meant to be negative 4 times 7, and so pressing enter will return the value of negative 28. All it has done is negative 4 times 7. Now interestingly enough, the negative button in your calculator is treated as a multiplier. When you press the negative button down here, your calculator is actually seeing that as negative 1 times whatever value you put in after it. So again, if I just type into the calculator negative 3, your calculator treats that as if it is negative 1 times 3. This will become important later as we are dealing with many, many operations and the order of operations. We have to know that our calculator sees this as multiplication.